All right, taking a look at Nero Trigger. It's a pretty awesome little gadget here. It's got five functions. Comes in a nice shiny box, two year warranty, $200. Uh, quite a bit cheaper than the uh, competitors out there. It's a nice looking little unit. Here's your mount. Takes two AAA batteries, and uh, which is pretty cool because the other one took um, nine volt, the previous model. And I've been pretty impressed with this little thing. I've been out playing with it. Um, it's got a fully digital interface, which is really cool. I'm digging that. So there's your lightning, your sound, time lapse your laser, you can point a laser at the front of this thing and when the light is broken it will trigger so you can do some pretty cool stuff with that it has an HDR mode for auto bracketing and then a DIY mode which is way above my head uh, and then each one of these has a sub menu to it so you click start on lightning then you can get your sensitivity that you want for when you're shooting the lightning same with the sound trigger and so on and so forth this is a pretty neat little unit here, so I'm going to show you some of the uh, shots I've gotten with it coming up here. should mention one more thing, it does have a uh, pretty cool mode as well, a uh, power saving mode. It goes into after I think a few seconds of not being used, or when you hit start, it turns itself off after uh, three seconds to save the battery life, which is pretty cool. This indicates when it's firing. You can see it's picking up my voice right now in sound mode and it's firing. Alright, uh, Neuro Trigger Sound Function test. Fired. Let's see what we got. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's see the water's all shooting around in midair here. The storm out in front of us here is putting on quite the show right now. So right now we're just going to wait. Because momentarily, there's going to be a very large bolt. There we go. That was a nice bolt to find in there. Let's see what this looks like real quick. Oh yeah, that was pretty. Video camera's kind of blowing out the photos there's a lot more data there than what you're seeing but man look at that